Hi, Scorps. It's me, Shani. Catalyst to Rogan soon. Yeah, yeah. What's up, Scorps? What's <sighs> up, gang, gang? Welcome to you versus them for the 1st to the 7th of, no uh, of December. I've been trying so hard not to say dis November. <sighs> Talk about backwards. Look, I'm going to clear the energy. <laughs> and then we'll get into it, okay? Nice, strong, even ding dongs. Or oh, do, dings, dings. Um, that was good. That was good, Scorp. It was consistent. It was deep. And it had a really nice ringtone at the end. So, um,. Mm, good start. Let's get into the overall energy, shall we? It's all, I just op I just opened it. Okay, it was two of cups. I opened it again. It was. I opened it again. It was the <laughs> Queen of Cups, and now I've opened it. It's the Lovers. Can you not? <laughs> overall energy for Scorpio, please. Scorpio for the first to the seventh of December. Overall energy for Scorpio. Oh my god. Oh my god. Libra just had this in their feelings. This is the overall energy. This is for you and your person. It's the wounded warrior. It's the take, having to take a step back, step out of the situation to see things more clearly. been defensive it's been on guard it's been absolutely and totally fucking aware of the shit that's been happening <laughs> get it that's what we want though that's that's who we are we're constantly analyzing things so that when the shit does hit the fan we're like oh but this 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 and this happened so this is why I'm like this, right? That's the energy. <gasps> right. Person's feelings. Scorpio's person's feelings, please. Spirit, thank you. Scorpio's person's feelings. Oh, they are feeling in love with you. on it though okay your person is in their feelings but there's a lid on it they're not fucking telling you jack shit let's be real queen of cups is the most ultimate loving queen but in this deck she's got a lid on it your feelings scorpio what is your feelings at the moment oh scorps really Scorpio, Five of Cups, not all is lost. I think you're feeling the loss of something that's happened. It could easily be that your person is closed off. You still have options, Scorpio. You always have options. You know that. There's two cups behind him. I know he's looking at the spilt cups. That is the feeling now, okay? It's the feeling now. The overall energy is the Nine of Wands. It's the defensive one. So your person's obviously feeling love but they don't want to show it okay they're not looking at it you're you are upset that this person is like this and it's put you in defensive mode depressive mode sadness mode not like full-blown depression but like you know you're not happy with the situation let's see what your person's next move is Your person is prepared to come and flash it around. Whether or not they're doing it for you, to you, 
or for themselves? I don't know. We will clarify that. They are not facing you, Scorp. They are facing the other way. Okay? So this could all be for self-gratification, is what I'm saying. while well, you're feeling like... Oh, what is your desire, Scorpio, in this situation? What is your desire? Like, oh my god, that's too much of a story. I saw Hanged Man and Ten of Cups. Go figure. Uh, Scorpio's desire, please, Spirit. Queen of Pentacles. You just... Scorps, you just want to be content and you're going to focus on self you're going to focus on your money your business your life your practicality you're going to be your desire is to just stay stable throughout all of this shit this person is putting you through the shit and they don't give a fuck because they're not even looking at you it's all about them Scorpio okay get into it let's get into it what's the potential outcome please for Scorpio potential outcome potential outcome please potential outcome for Scorpio that's not good potential outcome for Scorpio but that is <laughs> oh my god guys Thank you. Right. Where do we start? <sighs> Eight of Swords. Scorps. This is not okay. I mean, yeah, okay. Do it for like 24 hours. That's what I always say. If you're going to feel and be a neg ball, okay, if you're going to be a Debbie Downer or a negative Nelly or a Felicia or a Karen, I only do it for a day. You've got the rest of the fucking week, okay? This is frustration. It's feeling like you can't do anything about the situation. Please don't stay in this energy. And the reason that I'm really saying it in this way is because I'm dramatic. <laughs> it's because of the Ace of Wands. There is the opportunity of a passionate new beginning, whether it's with someone or something. Or just with yourself. Self. Male phallic. New path however it resonates something unexpected is going to come in and happen this is our card tower card Scorpio rebirth death tower <laughs> the universe is going to come and shake this shit up The universe is going to fucking, like, set this shit on fire. Let's get into the clarification. Let's clarify all this stuff. Wow, this is, this is very similar to Libra's read. Uh, and Scorpio, you and Libra have been mirroring each other for weeks. Weeks! Uh, Nine of Wands. Why is the Nine of Wands the overall energy for Scorpio and what else do we need to know about it? Thank you. Nine of Wands for Scorpio. Thank you. Ace of Swords. Epiphany. Brand new idea. Going through the ringer. Ringer, ringer. Reaching the bottom because that's the tower moment right when this when something happens and you just go epiphany fuck why didn't i see that before why was i here oh god i was here for no reason i was here for well there's always growth and negativity but you know what i mean that's fucking awesome. That is awesome. Right, 
Queen of Cups, why is your person closed off? Why is your person so full of love but they don't want to share it around? Really? Really? Why? Because they find balance in it. They, 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 they are content being closed off and, and knowing, they already know that they're, they've got love. Whether it's all for themselves or they do have love for you, they're just not showing you or telling you. Um, they're keeping themselves in balance. They're keeping their feelings balanced. They don't want an upheaval, okay? That makes sense. I mean, it's, you know, that does make sense. If th maybe they're not used to having so much emotion for somebody and that's why they've closed it off. They can't handle Scorpio's jandal, right? King of Wands. Why is the King of Wands here? And why is he not... I, I'm getting boss energy from the King of Wands because he's not facing you. So uh, the King of Wands is facing himself. I, it's a real controlling energy. I feel as though your person is controlling their energy to the max. Like their passion, their emotions, they've, they've locked it down. Like to fine art even. Why is the King of Wands here for Scorpio's person please? Too many... King of Wands for Scorpio's person. Why is King of Wands the next move? Why is the King of Wands Scorpio's person's next move? Too many. Ah, yeah. oh. Queen of Cups again. You know Queen of Cups is a Scorpio card, right? Your person is feeling you to the fucking max and they don't like it. This King of Wands is clarified by the Queen of Cups, who is a spiritualist, emotionally grounded, emotionally intelligent, um, that's the most loving queen of all the queens. She nurtures, she cares. She can be manipulative when it comes to emotions, but generally on herself, not others. Scorpio, your person loves the shit out of you and it scares them the fuck to the point where they've closed off. They're so focused on what they're doing because that's where they can control things um, because it brings them balance, okay? Right, Scorps, let's get, in, let's get into you, the Five of Cups. Not very happy with the way things are. You know, Scorpio, you are the most intuitive sign of the zodiac. So I've heard, and I kind of believe it, because I'm a Scorpio and I should know that. Um, you, you really just see things all the time. You know, you feel things all the time. You dream things all the time. <laughs> um, I feel as though you know this person has a lot of love for you and that they're, they're, they're closed off and not showing it. And that is a painful place to be when you can see how much value you have and you feel that person, feel that value, but they don't show it easily easily put you into this this energy all right scorpio i'm going to scorpio now please why is the five of cups here can you clarify the five of cups yeah because at one point it was full on at one point it was it, it was a lot it was a lot of passionate action um movement there, there some things happen here Something has happened. Your person is closed off to you, but I feel as though once upon a time it wasn't. That would fuck me off. Right, Queen of Pentacles. We have clarification on the Queen of Pentacles for Scorpio, please. Thank you. Right. Scorps, this is where we live right now. This is where we live with our friends, celebrating. Um, 
taking solace in the stars, the universe, embracing our spirituality, embracing practicality, responsibilities, you know, um, keeping that mindset, mind, or like or bringing in that mindset of um, happiness. Scorpio, you could even start dating again. Right, let's get into the potential energies. The Eight of Swords here, the frustration is still lingering, okay, next week. It's still there, um, but it's self-imposed. It's, it's like, it's hard to explain without sounding really judgmental, but you're kind of like doing it to yourself, you know? It's the overthinking. It's the lack of focus on you. You're more focused on this person to the point where you're just blinded and fucking tied up but <sighs> you don't have to be here scores okay eight of swords well, that was quick eight of cups walk the fuck away eight of cups you don't need it you don't need it you don't need that. Eight of Swords clarified with Eight of Cups. Walk away. Walk away. Get the fuck out of there. Right, Ace of Wands. <laughs> Ace of Wands. Why is the Ace of Wands here? Please clarify the Ace of Wands for Scorpio. Ace of Wands for Scorpio. Oh. Oh. Look who's turned up. You may have a new interest. Could be a water sign. But they're young, they know what they want, and they're willing to put in the work. And they may have a big wand, okay? This is someone new, Scorps. This is someone new coming in for you. He's got everything organised. He's got the white horse ready for you. He's got the picnic. He's got the flowers. And he's hot and young <laughs> <Feels better. laughs> that's enough to get you out of that five cups energy all right why is the tower here <laughs> why is the tower here oh too many why is the tower here for scorpio please why is the tower here for scorpio too many why is the tower here for Scorpio, please? Please and thank you. Tower for Scorpio. Ooh, come on. Tower for Scorpio. There we go. Fell straight on it. Hanged man. Hang on, I'm trying to I'm trying to get the words together because of the complexity of these two cards together. Something unexpected but life-changing is going to happen while you're in stagnation. Okay? The universe is going to come and do something while you're in self-reflection and stagnation. I don't think you see this person coming. They're either water sign or a fire sign. I don't think you see them coming. And I, I just saw 1919. I don't think you're going to be disappointed. In the meantime, you're walking away from all this other fuckery because your person's, honestly, they love the shit out of you and they're just not even going to fucking say anything. And how bloody disgusting is that? <laughs> honestly but in saying that wounded warrior only for a short amount of time epiphanies on the way brand new start clarity truth honesty 
love, romance and sex. It doesn't get any better than that for us Scorps. Just remember to please stay focused, stay grounded and definitely stay in touch with your friends. They are there for you, okay? This was a good read. I, I really wish you all the best. Um, make good decisions. I love you guys. Thanks for being here. Please like this video so that we can manipulate the algorithms so other Scorpios can see this advice. See the story. Um, even if it doesn't resonate, it's going to resonate for somebody, okay? Um, I'll see you on TikTok or I'll see you next week. I love you guys so much, okay? Take care, Scorps. Bye.